some kind of a meteor crash or something. I, I, I don't know what it is, but there's smoke and, uh, oh shoot. Oh my God. Okay, smoke. My, my dad and Armand are gonna go on. She got, smoke's coming. What? Hey, kids, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 shoot. Oh God, okay. Um, we, we don't know what it is. There's, there's some kind of smoke. Oh, what the, what the heck? What? What's what's going on? What? Oh 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 oh! I'm on. What? I'm on. Is it what? What's going on? The danger is what? Oh 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 god! Ah uh, no! I'm on. No no what? What's going on? I'm on. Oh shit! Oh, oh my god! We all heard a very large explosion outside of our house. It immediately hit the ground. I didn't know what it was, was coming. Going on we there. could tell it was coming from the backyard, but we didn't know where. We looked outside the windows, and then we saw smoke rising. It was really we scary. We all three of us ran up together to see my dad and my brother running down the stairs toward the bushes where the smoke was coming. They, my dad told me to stop, but it was, I was like two tenths up. It was like a horror movie, kind of. Uh, we, we went into the trees, um, uh, noticed the alien spacecraft had crashed there, or so, some kind of uh, spacecraft, and um, we saw the alien. And there it was. It was a, rep a, a reptilian creature. It had scales. It was clear. Um, it had something that looked like a jetpack, a gun, I have no idea, on its back. Um, it was very small. And it uh, it jumped at me. Um, it shot something out of its mouth. I don't, I don't know what it was. It was jello. So it was, I, I have absolutely no idea. But when it hit my face, it burned. It burned like the fires in hell. Every time I touch my head, I, can, I relive those memories. And uh, it's horrible. I relive the death, the pain. The smell of rotting flesh. After that, I pretty much blanked. I don't remember too much. I was being carried, and um, I was sent to the hospital. My friend Armand, when he was hit in the face with a beam, he staggered out of the bushes, clutching his face. Uh, when I ran down to him, I was so scared. I, I ran down to him, and his face... It was deformed. There were. I, I couldn't tell what was coming out. Was it pus? Was it some sort of alien life oozing out of his face? He looked like he was in such pain. And for 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 the next week, all he could do was scream. He he he, he just sat in the bed and screamed until he couldn't scream anymore. He screamed himself to sleep. Wake up the next morning, scream more. It was horrible. <laughs> so after my years of service in the military, I, I grabbed my uh, service revolver, which I still had, and uh, ran to the back door. And uh, the uh, I noticed some smoke out behind the the uh, trees. So we ran down, Armand and I, um, ran toward the trees, and the kids started to follow us. We asked them to stop. Uh, I didn't know what was going on out there at that point, so we asked them to stop, but they didn't listen. They followed us anyway to the trees. Uh, we we went into the trees, um, uh, noticed the alien spacecraft had crashed there, or so, some kind of uh, spacecraft, and uh, we saw the alien. And my first thought was to try to communicate to uh, to establish some kind of contact with the alien, and then Scaly I noticed Scaly and kind of clear had bat-like wings and a beak. It was clear and white, and it it had a beak and wings, and it was it scary. It was clear and scaly, and it had a beak and wings. It was like black leathery-ish wings. So I noticed that it had three eyes, and uh, so at that point I thought it'd be better just to shoot it. So I So I shot it. <laughs> And uh, uh, we came running out of the uh, the, uh, the bushes. Armand had, in, in the meantime, gotten some alien gel of some type on his face. Oh, oh shit! Oh, oh my gosh! 
was starting to dissolve his skin. And uh, so we picked him up. He was laying on the ground and, uh, and, and tried to get him away. The, the kids helped me, and, and we took him away. And uh, then uh, he, uh, he was hospitalized for several weeks after that. Um, and I, I don't know if he'll ever fully recover.